What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to change the sizes of our slider show made using Revolution Slider WordPress plugin in its version 6. So we already have made an amazing playlist of video tutorial and guides video in video using Revolution Slider plugin in its version 6 and I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here for this playlist. We already learned how to create a slider from the ground, clone elements, add buttons, actions, and much more. And in today's video, we're gonna see a simple method of change to change the size of the slider, the height and the widget of the slider. So first of all, go to our WordPress dashboard, Revolution Slider, hover over the slider that you want to edit, and go to the pencil icon to load the slider content. Now, if you look at the right top corner of our slider, we're gonna find a CUG icon, the setting icon, and we're gonna click on Layout. In Layout, we're gonna find the very first option called Type. We want the slider. We do not want another source, but I'm gonna show in a future, in a future video. And now we're gonna have a look at the sizing option. Our slider is set as full widget. Why is set as full widget? Because we want to change the size, we want to customize it. So we're gonna be looking at the layout. In the layout area size, you can set specific size for every single browser dimension that you want. For example, notebooks, tablets, phones, but by default, it only gonna change the dimension in the browser using the computer and the others gonna follow it. But you can set a zone to customize the slider size in a custom device size. For example, on, on, mobile, on, on mobile phones and set a custom size. Here, as you can see, if you change the H or the widget, you're gonna change the slider proportion of the sizes and you can make it bigger or smaller by changing this proportion. Now, we can find the advanced settings with a couple of more options and the model background. This is in the case that the image is not uploaded or can be loaded. You can set a background image or a background color in the case that you want. Now, as you can see, we have a border overlay and shadow option. This is a very nice option that add a pattern behind the slider, background image and change the slider style. But let's set it back to the normal and go back to the sizes of our slider. Let me just show a couple of options that you have included on your Revolution Slider plugin. Now, if you go back to the sizing options, you can, you can have a full screen slider. This setting gonna make the slider get the entire screen, the entire dimension, dimensions. But if you set this, the layout area size, the custom sizes, where you can see that we change it to change the slider H previously, will not have effect because you set as full screen. For this reason, we're gonna be setting as full widget and playing with the sizes as much as you want. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmodo.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes. And I see you later. All the best!